I've always been somebody who believes there are no barriers. Meet B. Jaramillo. I am the Director of Human Resources here at the Hilton Austin. I've been here, it will be 18 years in January, still on my honeymoon. B cares deeply about creating opportunities for people in difficult circumstances. So when two team members offered to bring in Afghan refugees in need of work, B was excited to help. What she didn't expect was who would show up at the hotel the next day. I had a total of 17 people standing in front of me. I was beside myself. I was overwhelmed, but I was so excited. So I looked at my staff and I said, we're going to make this happen. We just have such a great culture here. Everybody's so caring. And sometimes these team members don't believe in themselves. But we have done everything we possibly can to help them. And I will say probably 95% of them walked out with an offer. Over the past year, B has helped hire more than 70 refugees from Afghanistan, part of Hilton's commitment to hire 1,500 refugees by 2025. It's always an interesting story where they came from, what they were doing before they came here. They're in a new country, and I will say for our Afghan refugees, the sad part for me is that they have to leave a lot of their families back home. Helping them move forward is a high priority for Hilton and for B. That's what's most important to me is where will they be in five years? You know, and and what can we do to contribute to that? I found in my research that feeling appreciated is a surprisingly powerful motivator at work. B and the Hilton team have gone further. They've worked to make these new team members feel more at home. They've provided resources to help with learning English, as well as a place for prayer. They've also made accommodations surrounding Ramadan, adjusting the timing of breaks, and offering dinner in the team member cafeteria before sundown. If you're walking through the kitchen at noon and it's prayer time, there is not a steward behind that dish machine feeding dishes. They're on the other side of the dish machine where they have essentially created their mosque. And it's prayer time. And I love to tell those stories to my family because while we all, as individuals, have our own faiths, our own beliefs, our own story, so do they. And I am so proud of the other 300 plus team members who have accepted it. It's just a part of daily life now. Hilton hasn't created a culture of assimilation. They've created a culture of accommodation, inclusion, and celebration. When they sit down to eat dinner, they all sit together. They push all the tables together. And it's a feast. And they will ask anybody that walks by... They want to hand you something, a piece of bread or a plate and come and fill it up. You know, that's what to me hospitality is about. And that is what our guest doesn't see, but they can certainly feel it in the product. I think every time I see them together or laughing or high-fiving or really enjoying working here, That's the reward. Are you looking to be a part of something bigger in an industry full of opportunities? Learn more about Hilton's award-winning inclusive culture and find a job you'll love at jobs.hilton.com.